The Hunting Show, brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. Hello, everyone. Welcome to The Hunting Show on WZTS TV, Cozy TV, powered by Park Center Sporting Goods. Today, I got Brent Crookshanks. He's the owner of Park Center Sporting Goods. And Brent, we're going to talk about a new law that was passed in West Virginia about uh, sales tax on, sales tax, I should say, free on uh, guns and ammunition. Right, yeah. So it's been a while since we've been able to do anything here. You know, it's been a little while since we had a new episode. So I hope everybody's having a good summer so far. And there's been a few things that's been happening here during the summer. Uh, you know, the, the new bill that the, that the governor passed that there's no sales tax on any gun, ammo, and then most of the ammo components, which is pretty, you know, pretty big savings. They're, whatever the price you see on the tag is the price you pay. So there's no added cost, you know, as far as sales tax goes. Another thing, you know, a lot of the firearms have been tougher to get lately uh, in, in the last few months, but things have started to loosen up a lot. And we've got quite a few nice ones here, like this Winchester uh, Model 70 264. Uh, you know, we keep, we keep a lot of the classic stuff. Here's even a, uh, a side lock uh, Traditions 50 cal Kentucky rifle. I mean, we keep a lot of that stuff, but also, you know, we keep some of this other wild looking stuff that this is a Chris Vector uh, carbine. I mean, this is some wild looking stuff. This stuff's starting to become available, stuff that you haven't seen really in years. Uh, we got a Wilson Combat AR, and we have a lot more like these items here. And you know, Glock, Sig, even the Henry rifles are starting to come back. You know, during COVID, uh, Henry got four to six months behind on production, so they're trying to play catch up as as well as most of these manufacturers are. And even on the ammo end, we've started getting some ammo in that we hadn't had. You know, 22 ammos kind of coming back. Uh, the nine millimeter, two two three. The hunting rounds are still kind of tough to come up, come up with, but, and I don't think they'll be any better by fall. So if, if you guys are able to find any hunting ammo, I would probably go ahead and purchase it now if you're planning on needing it by fall because I don't believe there'll be a lot by fall. Uh, but things are getting better, uh, mainly because the consumers aren't as, uh, you know, not trying to buy it as quick. There's not a lot of panic buying like there was. Right. So. Uh, that that's helped some so when we do get some inventory in it lasts a little bit longer so the consumers not are not as worried about not being able to get anything the hunting show brought to you by park center sporting goods welcome back to the hunting show on wzts tv cozy tv Powered by Park Center Sporting Goods. Brent, that was some great information. We talked about the guns you got here, ammo. I was curious about this gun right here. Is that a 40 caliber right there? That is. It's a Chris Vector carbine. I mean, they think something wild. It looks like something a Star Trooper would use on Star Wars, didn't it? It's really neat. Something that you don't see very often. What I'm trying to say is, you know, a lot of these weapons that we haven't seen in quite some time are starting to come available again. Uh, it's really lightweight. Neat. It's pretty lightweight. Yeah, try it out. It's pretty neat. It's just different, isn't it? It is. It's different. not real heavy. It's no. uh, got the collapsible stock. Got some flip-up sights. Wow. Uh, it's pretty neat. It's definitely a long ways away from something like this Traditions 50 cal muzzle loader that's that was used several years ago. That's all everybody ever had, isn't it? It's totally that's different right. from yeah. that. That's a beautiful, beautiful gun though with the bra brass uh, accents. And then you also have we got this uh, Winchester. This is a super grade, which has got wow. this beautiful walnut stock, high gloss finish. It's in a 264 wind mag. Check that one out. Brent, these are the kind of rifles right here I see when I watch the old westerns on TV. Yep. yep. I can see me riding a horse stock. now, coming through <laughs> town. You know, here I come. I'd like to see that. <laughs> we also got some some firearms, maybe for the ladies. That's you know, this is called a Robin's Egg Blue. It's a 380. It's made by Walther. It's a beautiful gun. Uh, you know, sometimes uh, some of the guys pick on the ladies for, for buying something to call her, but I mean, why not? Hey, ain't no shame in my game. I like it, call her. That may be something I might sure carry around it. myself right there. I like it, baby. You could ride your horse with that, couldn't you? I ride my horse with that, too. We've even got a couple, you know, here's a purple and a pink one that has like a, a, a red dot slide already installed on it. 
Uh, those are really neat. They're, They're lightweight. Purple. I was going to say, this purple one right here, I know a fella that would love this right here. His name's Tommy. His uh, favorite color is purple. Oh, is it really? Yes, sir. Huh. Yes, sir. Well, I think I know him too, don't I? Yeah. I yeah. thought so. Good yeah, friend of ours. So. Yeah, yes, yeah. Sir. And then you got this beautiful, uh, like, Henry rifles with the brass accents. This one's called a Golden Boy. It's 22. It's got a large loop. This is something that we sell a ton of for, like, birthdays. And everybody just seems like they want a, a Henry rifle. It's 100% it's American made. I remember these right here, Brent, when I was a kid growing up. I mean, these right here, my dad would buy us one of these Henry's. Uh -huh. And he'd take us out in the backyard, put up an old, like, Coke or Pepsi yeah. can, and we do some target shooting oh, in the yeah. backyard. Man, that's some good memories I had with my dad. Yeah, that's, that's, fun. That's, that's something that you'll never forget. We also got several handguns. The handguns are starting to come back. You got this Sig Legion. Uh, here's a Glock 19X. I really like this gun. I've got one of these. It, it fires really well. It's a good looking gun. I like that collar. It's got night sights. I like the Sig. I mean, that's a really nice gun. You know, we've even got some smaller guns that are, are easy to conceal, like these Springfield Hellcats. So we're going to talk about that here in a little bit. We've also, we're going to talk a little bit about some holsters for summertime carry. Right. Uh, we're even going to talk about some purses for some women that you can hide your gun in. We're going to talk about that here in a little bit. James will be talking about that. But look right. how small that is. It's something easy you can always put in your pocket. Absolutely. I remember I bought my holster from right. you about a couple months right. ago. Yes, sir. But uh, we're going we're gonna to talk about that in a little bit. And also here in a little bit, we're going to talk about something that guys should be doing now is maybe preseason scouting for deer season. You know, we're here in July. It's not going to be long. It's going to be time to be out there slinging some arrows and some bullets at some deer. So we're going to be talking about game cameras and some deer minerals. Uh, maybe it should be putting out now to kind of help the, the deer herd. We'll be talking about that here in a little bit also. It's nothing like good preparation no, for to not. get ready for the season. The Hunting Show brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. Welcome to Alloy SCU. Hi, I'm Deanna Valentine, and kids are our future. If you live, work, or worship in Fed County, then you are eligible to join Alloy Federal Credit Union. Alloy Federal Credit Union has two locations serving you. One at 515 Hinkle Road, right here in Fetville at Doug Philly Shops, and we are also located at 3574 Midland Trail, Alloy, West Virginia. Love Alloy Federal Credit Union! Alloy Federal Credit Union, bridging the gap to all of Fayette County. Hi, I'm Debbie. Hi, I'm David. Welcome, Welcome to, to Ace, Ace Hardware, Hardware of Rainel, West, West Virginia. Virginia. Here at Ace Hardware in Rainel, West Virginia, we have several of your heating and plumbing and electrical needs, any kind of home repairs, roofing, concrete mix, plus we have electrical and plumbing hardware for all your home needs. We also carry power tools. We have some canning supplies for all seasons. We have decorative flags. We're a full service dealer with a full time mechanic and a full part selection. We also keep steel oils, also, we keep a full selection of steel chains and bars in stock and can make chains for any various saws. And we practically have all accessories for steel products in stock. Here at Ace Hardware in Raynell, we also have the remotes for your transponder keys. We have the replacement keys. We are one of the very few places that stock these. They are like half off of what you would pay at the dealer. Plus, here at Ace Hardware, we can also, we have a sidewinder cutter where we can cut sidewinder keys. Plus, we can also cut basically every other key design made. Ace, Ace is a place, place, place with the helpful, helpful hardware, hardware folks in Raynell. Stop by today at 326 Main Street, Raynell, or call 304-438-8731. Crown Windows and Doors of Oak Hill, West Virginia is a manufacturer of premium vinyl windows and doors, plus commercial doors and windows. Our products are 100% American made by our local staff. There is no custom size, just your size. Crown Windows and Doors proudly serving our community for over 50 years. Crown Windows and Doors at 540 Industrial Drive, Oak Hill, West Virginia. Our number is 304-469-2260. To schedule your appointment today.
Jackson's Meat Shop, Webster Road, Somersville. When it comes to great seasoning, we've got you covered. Jerky seasoning, smoke flavored seasoning, pork seasoning, bologna seasoning, summer sausage seasoning, smoked Polish kielbasa seasoning, jalapeno jerky seasoning. Jackson's Meat Shop has you covered for on-the-go packaged jerky and beef sticks. Uncle Mike has great flavors like sweet and spicy, house blend, barbecue teriyaki, black pepper, maple, and habanero. We also have gluten-free beef sticks. When it comes to meat, we have the best steak, hamburgers, pork, and so much more. Jackson's Meat Shop, 3001 Webster Road, Somersville. We've got you covered from A to Z for all your grocery needs. Jackson's Meat Shop. firearms and ammo in the area. Over 50 years of combined experience, shop for guns, rifles, scopes, bow and arrows, knives, fishing rods, a great selection of boots like Danner, hunting clothes, and accessories. Park Street Sporting Goods is located at 410 John Rain Drive, Rainell. Open Monday through Saturday from 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. and Sunday from 12.30 p.m. to 5 p.m. or 24-7 online. For more information, call Park Center Sporting Goods in Rainell at 304-438-5660. The Hunting Show, brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. Welcome back to the Hunt Show on WZTS TV, Cozy TV, powered by Park Center Sporting Goods in Raydale, West Virginia. We're going to talk to Lee Taylor about some Lee. This here is some deer mineral we're going to talk about. Can you tell us a little bit about the deer mineral you got right here? Well, a lot of people know right now deer start to grow their antlers. Of course, those are having fawns. So they need the nutrition. They need the mineral to help grow their antlers. If you want to kill big bucks, you got to have some mineral. Um, definitely because right now it's hot, the, not, you're not getting a lot of rain, so you got drought. Uh, a lot of people like to feed corn and stuff. That don't help with antler growth and the nutrition for the fawns and the does through the year. So you need to get them some mineral. Um, twisted oats, we sell a lot of this through the year, uh, two or three normally pilots. Um, B&J head rush, it's great stuff. Um, you can also Early in the spring, this is a, what this is, is it's a food plot. So it's going to have grass that grows all year round. Uh, some stuff in it. Um, you'll have some attractant blocks. These have got corn, molasses like it. More of an attractant to get them to it. because They're going to smell that molasses, that corn. Then they're going to get to your mineral. That's, that's the big thing is definitely get your deer some mineral right now. Uh, so, Lee, we're going to talk about some cameras. What type of cameras you got over there? Well... Nowadays, everybody is putting cameras out. Got to see the big buck, find your hit listers, pattern your deer. Um, a season coming in early like it does, deer are still on a summer routine. So you want to do stuff like that. Um, your normal camera, these are just 14 megapixel cameras that take day and night pictures. Great for really anybody. And then now the big thing is cell cameras. That is the thing. You're going to download an app on your phone. You know, take a picture, it's going to send it right to your phone. So if you're sitting on a couch, Big bucks at your stand, you're gonna know he's there. Wow, it, it, it's it's a game changer. So which one is that right there? This one. The, 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 we got some Brownings, we got some Moultries, and uh, we have these coverts. Covert is the big thing right now with us. Um, we bought over 300 of these this year. Wow. Yeah. So these are only 199. This is gonna be a special from now till season. These are gonna be 149.95. That is a great deal for a cell camera. These run off AT&T service. With cell cameras, they're going to have antennas. And you know the black critters in the woods that like to play with stuff? Bears. Right. So, with your cameras, you're going to need a bear box. Even this even helps with the bears playing with it, um, stealing thieves. This keeps it protected. So, if you have, if you want to use, even use it for uh, surveillance at your house, these work great for that. Put a lock on them. They're steel. 
you're not going to get into that. And the bears are going to chew that up, take it from you, anything like that. Wow, good deal on that. $39.95, you can't beat that right there on this right here. No, you cannot. Wow, folks, some great deals we got on, going on uh, right here at Park Center Sporting Goods. Folks, come on and take advantage early and take advantage of all these great deals at Park Center Sporting Goods, folks. We'll be back to the hunting show on WZTS TV, Cozy TV, right after this break. The Hunting Show, brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. Welcome to Alloy SVU. Hi, how may I help you? Hi, I'm Deanna Valentine, and kids are our future. If you live, work, or worship in Beck County, then you are eligible to join Alloy Federal Credit Union. Alloy Federal Credit Union has two locations serving you. One at 515 Hinkle Road, right here in Fettville at Doug Village Shops. And we are also located at 3574 Midland Trail, Alloy, West Virginia. Love Alloy Federal Credit Union! Alloy Federal Credit Union, bridging the gap to all of Fayette County. Hi, I'm Debbie. Hi, I'm David. Welcome, Welcome to, to Ace, Ace Hardware, Hardware of Radio, Radio West, West Virginia. Virginia. Here at Ace Hardware in Raynell, West Virginia, we have several of your heating and plumbing and electrical needs, any kind of home repairs, roofing, concrete mix, plus we have electrical and plumbing hardware for all your home needs. We also carry power tools. We have some canning supplies for all seasons. We have decorative flags. We're a full service dealer with a full time mechanic and a full park selection. We also keep steel oils. Also, we keep a full selection of steel chains and bars in stock and can make chains for any various saws. And we practically have all accessories for steel products in stock. Here at Ace Hardware in Raynell, we also have the remotes for your transponder keys. We have the replacement keys. We are one of the very few places that stock these. They are like half off of what you would pay at the dealer. Plus, here at Ace Hardware, we can also, we have a sidewinder cutter where we can cut sidewinder keys. Plus, we can also cut basically every other key design made. Ace, Ace is, is a place, place with the helpful hardware, hardware folks in Raynell. Stop by today at 326 Main Street, Raynell, or call 304-438-8731. Crown Windows and Doors of Oak Hill, West Virginia is a manufacturer of premium vinyl windows and doors, plus commercial doors and windows. Our products are 100% American made by our local staff. There is no custom size, just your size. Crown Windows and Doors proudly serving our community for over 50 years. Crown Windows and Doors at 540 Industrial Drive, Oak Hill, West Virginia. Our number is 304-469-2260. To schedule your appointment today. Jackson's Meat Shop, Webster Road, Summersville. When it comes to great seasoning, we've got you covered. Jerky seasoning, smoke flavored seasoning, pork seasoning, bologna seasoning, summer sausage seasoning, smoked Polish kielbasa seasoning, jalapeno jerky seasoning. Jackson's Meat Shop has you covered for on-the-go packaged jerky and beef sticks. Uncle Mike has great flavors like sweet and spicy, house blend, barbecue teriyaki, black pepper, maple, and habanero. We also have gluten-free beef sticks. When it comes to meat, we have the best steak, hamburgers, pork, and so much more. Jackson's Meat Shop, 3001 Webster Road, Somersville. We've got you covered from A to Z for all your grocery needs. Over 50 years of combined experience, shop for guns, rifles, scopes, 
bow and arrows, knives, fishing rods, a great selection of boots like Danner, hunting clothes, and accessories. Park Street Sporting Goods is located at 410 John Rain Drive, Rain L. Open Monday through Saturday from 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. and Sunday from 12.30 p.m. to 5 p.m. or 24-7 online. For more information, call Park Center Sporting Goods and Rain L at 304-438-5660. The Hunting Show, brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. James, these are some nice purses. Do you care to tell us about each one that we got right here today? Well, our first lineup is Bulldog for a lot of these. They have the concealed carry pockets here in the sides, again with the holster, uh, Velcro to the inside. This is a different style of the same thing, also with the pocket here. Also have a version here that's more of a backpack. That's what I'm saying. It looks different. like kind of like a backpack you fit over your shoulders there. And again, these have the lockable zippers, so you can lock them up. We got some more standard leather. Again, these are Brownings and a Bulldog. These have the lockable zippers in the back on both sides. And this, which again has zipper accesses on either side. That right there reminds me like you're getting ready to go to the beach right there. It's That's got the beach too, collar yeah. stuff. So, folks, you want to come down to Park Center Sporting Goods in Raynell, West Virginia, and take advantage of these unique purses that you can conceal your weapon in when you go on vacation or when you're just shopping on your natural days. Folks, we'll be back to the hunt show right here on WZTS TV, Cozy TV, powered by Park Center Sporting Goods in Raynell, West Virginia. The Hunting Show, brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. Welcome to our SVU. Hi, how may I help you? Hi, I'm Deanna Valentine, and kids are our future. If you live, work, or worship in Beck County, then you are eligible to join Alloy Federal Credit Union. Alloy Federal Credit Union has two locations serving you. One at 515 Hinkle Road, right here in Fettville at Doug Billy Shops. And we are also located at 3574 Midland Trail, Alloy, West Virginia. Love Alloy Federal Credit Union! Alloy Federal Credit Union, bridging the gap to all of Fayette County. Hi, I'm Debbie. Hi, I'm David. Welcome, Welcome to, to Ace, Ace Hardware, Hardware of Radio, West, West Virginia. Virginia. Here at Ace Hardware in Raynell, West Virginia, we have several of your heating and plumbing and electrical needs, any kind of home repairs, roofing, concrete mix, plus we have electrical and plumbing hardware for all your home needs. We also carry power tools. We have some canning supplies for all seasons. We have decorative flags. We're a full service dealer with a full time mechanic and a full part selection. We also keep steel oils. Also, we keep a full selection of steel chains and bars in stock and can make chains for any various saws. And we practically have all accessories for steel products in stock. Here at Ace Hardware in Raynell, we also have the remotes for your transponder keys. We have the replacement keys. We are one of the very few places that stock these. They are like half off of what you would pay at the dealer. Plus, here at Ace Hardware, we can also, we have a sidewinder cutter where we can cut sidewinder keys. Plus, we can also cut basically every other key design made. Ace, Ace is a place with the helpful hardware, hardware folks in Raynell. Stop by today at 326 Main Street, Raynell, or call 304-438-8731. Crown Windows and Doors of Oak Hill, West Virginia is a manufacturer of premium vinyl windows and doors, plus commercial doors and windows. Our products are 100% American made by our local staff. There is no custom size, just your size. Crown Windows and Doors proudly serving our community for over 50 years. Crown Windows and Doors at 540 Industrial Drive, Oak Hill, West Virginia. Our number is 304-469-2260. To schedule your appointment today.
Jackson's Meat Shop, Webster Road, Somersville. When it comes to great seasoning, we've got you covered. Jerky seasoning, smoke flavored seasoning, pork seasoning, bologna seasoning, summer sausage seasoning, smoked Polish kielbasa seasoning, jalapeno jerky seasoning. Jackson's Meat Shop has you covered for on-the-go packaged jerky and beef sticks. Uncle Mike has great flavors like sweet and spicy, house blend, barbecue teriyaki, black pepper, maple, and habanero. We also have gluten-free beef sticks. When it comes to meat, we have the best steak, hamburgers, pork, and so much more. Jackson's Meat Shop, 3001. of a combined experience. Shop for guns, rifles, scopes, bow and arrows, knives, fishing rods, a great selection of boots like Danner, hunting clothes, and accessories. Park Street Sporting Goods is located at 410 John Rain Drive, Rain L. Open Monday through Saturday from 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. and Sunday from 12.30 p.m. to 5 p.m. or 24-7 online. For more information, call Park Center Sporting Goods in Rain L at 304-438-5660. The Hunting Show, brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods. Hey folks, welcome back to The Hunt Show on WZTS TV, Cozy TV, powered by Park Center Sporting Goods in Raynell, West Virginia. Brent, what a great, great show we had tonight, talking about the sales tax, no sales tax. Yeah, that's a great thing, you know, I mean, it's something we would have been excited about to, to be able to, whenever we show somebody a weapon or whatever, we say, this is the price. You don't have to pay anything extra. I mean, so that's great. That's just on guns and ammo. And, and ammo accessories like uh, reloading. It's like reloading powder and bullets, that kind of stuff. So that's just all, that's just in West Virginia. That's not a national law. That's just in West Virginia. So if you got something on a layaway with us and you come and pick it up, even then you want to pay layaway or pay the uh, sales, sales tax. tax on it. Yeah. I mean, a lot of, I mean, taxes sometimes, I mean, you look at next year, depends on the price. I mean, anywhere from next year, $10 to $30, $40. Well, yeah, I mean, a you lot take a $600 gun, it's $636 when you pay tax on it. So that's $36 you're going to save. So that's, that's a lot of, a lot of ammo you can buy with that. You can buy another holster or something. That's right. Exactly. Too. I mean, some great, that's a great, great incentive right there. Thanks to our uh, great state of West Virginia passing that bill right, right. there. What else, uh, Brent, that we got going on at Park Center? Well, I mean, we, we talked a little bit about, you know, pre-scouting pre for, for deer. That's something I enjoy this time of the year. Right. Uh, it's warm, but it's, it's still something fun that you can get out and enjoy the outdoors. Uh, we also talked about concealment, you know, how we can carry some holsters, how we can carry our weapons on us. Uh, you know, I was thinking about a few things, and, uh, you know, here we are right around the 4th of July or maybe just past, but aren't we just lucky to live in America? We are we're absolutely lucky to live in America. And I'll tell you what, Brent, the 4th of July weekend, you know, I went out and checked out some uh, racing, some racing going on right. with our good uh, friend Robert Moody that owns the Beckley uh, Speed Park over there. Right. And uh, we may have something in the future. We may we may race. Who knows? We might do that sometime in the future. We've been talking about that. We think that would be fun. Uh, me and you get in the car, we'll see what happens. I mean, who knows? I mean, it would be fun. But isn't it uh, just a, a, a privilege to be born in America and to live in America and to be able to enjoy the right work and just walk in here and, and buy a firearm? Uh, you know, we can, we, we don't have to, we can go to the racetrack and not have to let That's somebody right. else let us go. You know, we're just, we're just blessed to, to live in this country and, and I'm blessed to, uh, to do this for a living. Well, I'll tell you, Brent, you got a lot of nice products down here and uh, I know it's just, Fishing season's going on right now. Like, right. You got all kinds of fishing rods. I mean, you sell live bait in here. So, I mean, you got lures. You got everything you need for fishing. Tackle boxes. You name it, you have it for fishing. Yeah, we didn't mention a lot of that tonight because we had so many other things. But, yeah, I mean, right now is the, is the heat of fishing season. Uh, everybody's going out and catching some smallmouth bass and some catfish. And, 
And I've noticed a lot of young people in here have been buying fishing poles with their mom and dad. And you know, that's a if you get a chance to take a kid fishing that, that maybe doesn't maybe their mom and dad doesn't fish, take them out. You know, you you can make a memory. Uh, maybe that's something that that down the road, you know, they'll always remember that you took them fishing. And I know one thing: I still remember the first fish I ever caught. Wow! And how big was that fish? Well, it wasn't very big, but that it doesn't matter. But counted, right? but the memory is huge, exactly. Right. So. But anyway, you know how them old fishermen tell stories sometimes. They talk about a, f a fish. Sometimes it'd be like that, but then it kind of grows. Absolutely. So, you know, that's kind of like when we the deer and stuff. I mean, <laughs> they start out like this, one. but then they're really big by the time. And another thing I want to tell you about, I've always heard, when guys come in here and they miss a deer, it's always the biggest one. It's yep, a 10-point, you know, it was monster when they miss it. Right. <laughs> so anyway, I always thought that was pretty humorous. <laughs> I'll tell you a story. Uh, last year, we went fishing, uh, me and my wife and our five kids, mm -hmm. And my daughter, we got them a nice little fishing rods, like character, like Mickey yeah, Mouse, yeah, yeah. Minnie Mouse. Sure. Well, she had her Minnie Mouse, and we're sitting on the boat, and she was fishing. And she goes, Dan, Dan. And she dropped her fishing rod oh, really? into the water. Uh -huh. I couldn't get it. started crying. I said, man, I said, that was the biggest fish. They just took your rod down. Right. And you had the biggest fish of the day. I told her that right there. It's a smile on her face. Oh, yeah. You know, that, priceless. That's something I mean, she'll never forget. Take your kids fishing. Enjoy uh, fishing, folks. Britt, anything else we'd like to add uh, to the show, this episode, great episode. I just want to thank everybody for uh, for checking us out and watching this. I would like to, you know, throw in there that uh, we, we're trying to be really, uh, have a big uh, social media presence. So if you get a chance, like our Facebook page. Uh, we're on MeWe. You can just follow us on there. We do Twitter. Uh, James, he has a YouTube channel. It's called Rattlesnake Defense. He has a ton of information on there. Just go on YouTube, look him up. There's a ton of information. There's a lot of videos, uh, instructional videos that he's doing. He's, he's, do he's loading something just about every day. Uh, definitely check that out. Uh, that's the best way for us to keep in contact with you guys is through social media. We can't call every one of you. Uh, we're, we're even working on a, an email list now. We're going to try to email everybody, give email blast every so often on sale items or whatever. So. If you get a chance, check us out on Facebook, MeWe, Twitter. Check out James's Rattlesnake Defense on YouTube. And uh, we thank you guys for watching. Folks, thanks for tuning in right there. We'd like to thank all of our uh, sponsors, especially Park Center Sporting Goods, our main sponsor right here, for helping us put on this great, great show in Raynell, West Virginia. I'd like to thank Ace Hardware right here in Raynell, West Virginia as a sponsor. Jackson's Meat Shop in Summersville, West Virginia as a sponsor. Alloy Federal Credit Union in Alloy and in Fettville, West Virginia. And I'd like to thank Crown Windows in Oak Hill as a sponsor as well. Folks, go out there and visit our fine sponsors. And thank you for tuning in to The Hunt Show on WZTS-TV, Cozy TV. We'll see you next time, folks. Good night. The Hunting Show brought to you by Park Center Sporting Goods.